After a lot of requests, we put together this new Challenger gas lens kit. The kit shown here is for 17, 18, and 26 style torches, and it has the stubby gas lens hardware. It's got exactly what you need for making good quality welds on aluminum, stainless, chromoly. Comes with 332 hardware, that is the most versatile. A Furic wedge collet and a split CK collet. The standard ceramic number no. 5 cup with a standard collet body are so popular with really high end aluminum welders that we made sure to include that. A number no. 5 cup limits the cleaning action and the energy that normally goes out into that cleaning path gets focused into the puddle and therefore helps it penetrate on full penetration joints like this little this is not quite a butt joint here it's not quite an outside corner joint it's kind of an angled butt joint but full penetration is needed so whether you've got a small 920 style torch or a bigger 17 18 26 like you see here we've got a kit for you this kit comes with a furic stubby style gas lens with the o-ring groove that means you can upgrade the kit and use any large furic cup one really super useful cup is a number eight gas lens and this one comes with a clear as well as a pink ceramic I don't always use the clear I got started using the clear cups just to film the welding arc so we all could see a lot better but I discovered really early on that it helps me see better that glowing tungsten up inside the clear cup really does act kind of like a light bulb and lights your path Another benefit is you can see right through the cup, and that comes in really handy sometimes. It's not always needed, but sometimes you get a bad angle, and it's really helpful to be able to see the tip of your electrode right through the cup. But for general welding, again, it just lights everything up and helps you see better. And I'm in my 60s now, and it helps me a lot. But ceramic cups are more durable. So switching back to a pink ceramic cup is as easy as this. Just slide that clear cup off, remove the o-ring, and the, just use the threads on the cup and screw the ceramic cup right back on there, just like you would normally. Now you've got a stubby gas lens set up with a durable cup, and that works great too. You just don't see the puddle and see where you're going quite the same, but it provides really good results. The Jazzy 10 ceramic is one of the best cups I've ever used for chromoly and stainless steel. And the thing about it with that secondary diffuser in there, it's a double screen diffuser and it comes with extra ones. But it's just really the special sauce when it comes to getting good gas coverage without any more flow than you need for a number eight. Good gas coverage on stainless steel and chromoly is very important to get good looking welds. This is a chromoly cluster. It's a 120 thousandths wall thickness. And I'm using a little bit of a pedal pump technique here, but I think you can see that the gas shielding is providing a nice shielded weld. And sometimes you need a really long stick out to get into tight little corners, but you don't want to lose shielding just because you have to use a long stick out. You can get both with a Jazzy 10. It's also a great cup for stainless steel. With only about 20 CFH, which is about what I would use with a number eight cup, you can get really good coverage even while using about a three quarter inch stick out. You don't always need to use that long of a stick out, but you can easily do that with this cup. The Ceramic 12 is very similar. It just requires about roughly five CFH more than the Jazzy 10 ceramic, but for stainless steel, sometimes that's a small price to pay for getting good shiny stainless steel welds and maintaining that corrosion resistance and appearance. This is just a carbon steel outside corner joint, but you can see how well that ceramic 12 is shielding here, about two pulses a second for that weld. The reason we include two different insulators on this kit is because there's so many different kinds of torches out there and CK are a little different with their brass insert on the front. So one of these is designed for CK, the other is designed for every other torch. Comes with three different end caps, the short, medium, and long. Also comes with three pieces of 332 2% lanthanated tungsten. This is the kit for the 17, 18, and 26 style torches. It'll really shrink your torch size. If you already have the stubby gas lens, this is a great upgrade for that kit. And we also have it in the 920 torch version. In which case, the main difference is just this gas lens collet body. This is a CK gas lens 
They call it a 2GL332, also known as a 45V44 in other circles. If you're interested in leveling up your welding skills, this kit can really help.